If you've ever had issues consistently picking up the right size pearl, this video is going to completely blow you away. Greg is going to show you exactly how to pick up the perfect pearl for whatever size nail you need right now on Nail School. All right, bro. Acrylic pearls take us through the steps. So last night um, I was getting back to a customer who was asking me questions on Instagram about like how do I pick up consistent pearls from small to large because she's struggling with this. So I said, you know what, I'm gonna put something together and let's see if we can get something out. So this is that episode if you're out there. I'm gonna show you guys what I do so that you guys are going to have consistency across the board whether it's a small finger or a large finger. This is how I do it. Okay, there's two factors. First, the amount of liquid that you have in your brush Second is going to be basically how many times you bounce into the surface of the powder, right? I don't like to drag my brush across the surface because I feel that it picks up inconsistent pearls. What I like to show you is where I press my brush in the middle so that it releases everything, right, from it evenly. I don't like to drag it or basically press way low. For everyone out there that's starting, right in the middle, okay? So what I'm gonna show you is basically something for small, and then I'm gonna show you medium, and then we're gonna go to large. So if I take my brush and I press firm, what I wanna do is I wanna do a one count on the bounce. One, and you can see I'm going to pick up a, a really nice small pearl, and you can see that size right there. Now, I'm gonna match that, okay? Watch this. Do the same thing. Take my brush, I'm going to, let's go ahead and shake this out so it's flat. I'm gonna take my brush, I'm gonna press firm, one, and as you can see, I have the same size pearl. Right next, I'm just gonna wipe it off right next to it. This is a great way that you can practice so that you get consistent pearls across the board. Again, submerge my brush, press firm, count to one, and then as you can see, I have three of the same size pearls, okay? So, I'm gonna raise this up a little bit right here. I'm gonna place my next pearls right below to show you basically how to get something in the medium, in the medium range. If I submerse my brush, this time instead of pressing firm, I'm just going to press medium, okay? so. It's, it's, it's weird, it's, it's like you have a really firm press, you have a medium press, and you have a very light press, okay? So I'm gonna do a medium press, and I'm gonna count to two. One, two. And as you can see, I'm going to get something a little bit bigger than that. Same thing. I'm gonna submerse my brush, I'm gonna lightly press, I'm gonna count to two. One, two. And as you can see, as I set this down, I'm starting to get larger pearls. Not that much bigger than this, but obviously bigger as I wipe it onto my towel. Submerse it again, lightly press, two count. One, two, and as you can see, I'm going to get something again within this range right here. That's what we want. This time, I'm gonna show you guys a three to four count. Remember, Light press, and we're gonna bounce into the surface three to four times. Get my brush wet, lightly press, one, two, three. Look at how much bigger that pearl is. I mean, you can see the gradual increase in size, right, but not by much. Again, take my brush, lightly press, one, two, three. And again, as I press it out, it's going to be basically the same size. I mean, take a look at the width of the, of the brush indentation. It's basically the same size as you can see. I'm gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna submerse my brush, lightly press. Let's go ahead and flatten this out. One, two, three. And I'm gonna do the same exact thing. And as you can see, look at that. Three consistent pearls 
across the board. And, and again, if I want to go larger, right, I need more liquid so I can go as, as much as basically barely touching, barely touching, one, two, three, four, five. Look at how big that one, be that is obviously much bigger than that. Again, lightly press, one, two, three, four, five. And as you can see, as I'm working down, again, bigger than this one, but not to the point where it's like double or triple the size. You're always, and again, depending on the finger that you're working with, if you're working with a thumb, sometimes you have someone who has a really large finger, you're gonna need to do that. You're gonna need to barely touch it, one, two, three, four, five. I'm gonna get a really, really nice pearl. And as I set that down, take a look, right, at the consistency across the board from small to large. This is how you're going to practice. This is how you're going to build consistency with young nails, liquid, and powders. And this is going to give you the most success when it comes to any size finger you work on.